Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. This is Sargama and this video is a part of All About Music Business for Independent Artist, which is a YouTube music video series that I have released and uh, more videos are coming every Friday on this channel to educate you about music business if you are an independent artist and you are releasing music on your own. Yeah, so today we are going to discuss the major difference between two important things. One is music distribution and another is music publishing you need to know the difference between them if you are an artist and you release your music on your own and via not any label or something even if you release through a music label then also you should know the insights and the knowledge of your music industry and little things like difference between distribution and publishing because uh, you should know in what business you are and how is it handled so music distribution as it sounds is basically distributing your music to various platforms like uh, spotify apple music uh, Instagram, Facebook Reels and Deezer, Pandora, SiriusXM and Ghana, Wink, Hangama for India and a lot of other streaming like uh, more than 100 or 150 streaming platforms are there on which you can distribute your music so that people can listen to your songs on any platform wherever they feel comfortable like uh, I am comfortable on Spotify, someone else must be comfortable on YouTube music so on so forth so they can listen to your songs on any platform they are comfortable with and which they use for listening to music this is music distribution now music publishing see once you have distributed your songs it is available worldwide on uh, the music streaming platforms for people to listen to but music publishing is important for you to claim rights on that song on every platform and to earn money from them through a different way okay so uh, first things first if you want to learn more about music distribution and how does that work and what are the companies that you should consider as your music distributor and all of the other stuff i have a special dedicated video on music distribution and i've compared uh, five major music distribution companies and even i use one of them for my song distributions so you can check that video from the link in description or you can check that here in the card the next thing about which i said publishing i also have a dedicated different video where i tell about different types of society where publishing is one of the main important aspect that i cover also you can check that video somewhere here uh, so there are two videos basically one is about the streaming royalty and the other one is about difference between different societies and how do they pay you out to be honest i'll prefer if you can watch this all about music business for independent artist series from top till here like start with the first video so it is like a free course that we are doing on here on youtube yeah i'm telling you about everything that you must know if you are a musical artist and you release your music so if you watch this uh, complete series from top like from the first video, second, third, fourth, then you will, you know, gain knowledge in uh, line. Like the first things first, uh, you should know, then second, third. So it is kind of a course and I'll suggest you to watch the series like that. If you still do not want to do that way, you can check out specific videos that uh, interest you and you can get all the links in the description or somewhere in the cards in between yeah cool so the next thing is music publishing what music publishing is music publishing is publishing or registering your songs in pros what is a pro pro is performance right organizations and every country has a different pro like india we have iprs and i have told everything about pros and other organizations also in detail in the video uh, where I compare uh, different four or five organizations which work together and pay you every penny your song is earning. So I'll suggest you to check that video out and uh, publishing. Let's get back to the business. Publishing. Publishing is registering your songs in a PRO. See, if you are in India, let's suppose like I am based in India, right? If you are in India, uh, you can register your song in IPRS, which is Indian Performance Right Organization. See, in today's world, if you like it or not, every release is a worldwide release. So you are releasing music digitally. People in USA can also listen to your songs. People in, people in India are also listening to your songs. People in somewhere in Europe or Switzerland or like... It is worldwide yeah so everyone can listen to your song in any part of the world so if you are earning royalties from that particular pro in that country how will you claim that for that you need to publish your music via a publishing entity or a publishing administrator see these two are really different things publishing entity is basically your own company that you have set up which publishes your songs in every pro 
of every country around the world i will not suggest anyone who is starting out right now to do it because it's really expensive and it takes a lot of time and management into it uh, the best alternative is publishing administration so it is actually a music publishing entity but it is set up by someone else who is already in the business and they have set up the whole company and their main motive and main business is to publish songs and register it in PROs of majority countries around the world like approximately 100 150 countries around the world and claim your royalty from those and take just a minimum amount of uh, you know administration kind of percentage from your royalties and then pay you the rest so this is basically music publishing via publishing administration so the publishing administrator that i use is song trust and uh, their fee structure is really simple song trust charges 100 dollars one time fee in the starting for publishing your songs via your name like if uh, my name is sir gama so they publish my songs in every other society via sir gama or even if you have any entity of yours you know which you have uh, already established and you want song trust to register your songs in other part of the world then you can give them your entity's name and they can you know register the songs via that entity's name as i told you song trust charges 100 dollars one time fee after that they collect royalties and register your songs from throughout the territories that uh they are collaborated with like with different nations and different pros which is i guess approximately around 150 if i'm not wrong but if you register to song trust via my link which is in the description you will get instant 10 dollars off and you just have to pay 90 dollars as a first time fee and not 100 there is one more thing that i want to tell you especially if you are from any country or from any region which song trust does not cater to like i am from india so song trust does not collect direct royalties from india so what i had to do i had to register myself as a publisher as i told you in the starting of the video also i registered myself as a publisher in iprs which is india's pro and the charges for that is 2200 one time fee for lifetime and then i am registered as a publisher in my country right so i am collecting royalties from my country directly through iprs and from the other countries via song trust so if the song trust is not catering your home country you can register in your pro by yourself as a publisher and the royalties of the rest of the countries will be collected via song trust for you so this is the major difference between distribution and publishing a song so in a nutshell distribution is just uploading it on various platforms but publishing is basically registering it in every pro so that it makes sure your song is registered in every country it is being played in and then you claim your money from every country's pro that you are owed publishing is one of the best thing that you should do if you release your own music and if you want me to distinguish between different publishers that are out there and if you want a comparison between them and you want to know more about them please leave a comment in the video i'll be happy to help you guys and if you like the content that i share and if you like the education that i give about music business for independent artist please hit that like button and subscribe press the bell icon and share and do everything that you can actually it helps the channel a lot it motivates me to make more and more videos and provide all the knowledge that i have gathered in a lot of years and by spending hundreds and thousands of dollars giving it to you for free because these are the basics that everyone should know before entering into the industry or even before finalizing that they want to be a music producer or a musical artist or a anything in this industry on instagram and on my other socials i keep on posting my recent dj gigs upcoming dj gigs upcoming uh, music releases music video snippets educational content like this and a lot of stuff so please make sure you guys follow me on instagram if you want to listen to my original songs you will get the link in the description or in the card here also somewhere and if you want to check out my nft store i'll be making a video on nfts for musical artist also in this video series so stay tuned to check that please help me reach my goal so see you next friday next week with another new topic new video new educational content on all about music business for independent artist this is sir gama sign out